Hello, 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 and welcome today to some Until Dawn. If you missed episode one, it's over my Zerka Play channel. If not, it's also linked down below in the description, top line. Uh, we started this game uh, literally an hour ago. Obviously, for you, it might be longer than an hour ago. Um, we've done chapter one. We're now going into chapter two. Uh, this game came out in 2015. It's been remade. Man, now, like PC times. Every time I climb it. Updated. Oh, yeah? It feels the same to me. And that's me, Josh. I'm Hannah and Beth's brother. And Hannah and Beth died a year ago. He's creative, playful, and persistent. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey guys, get up here okay? Yeah. Oh. More or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? He's pissed because he's seen his girlfriend hugging her ex. Yo, yo, yo. We need to get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. He reminds me of like... What's the film? There's a film where there's a kid who wears glasses. Polar Express. He reminds me of the kid in Polar Express. I don't know why. Uh, gossip with Matt and Emily. Worry. You doing all right? Yeah, we're worried about him. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sis. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? You're over it. Like your always sister's used. died. They're missing. Damn it. This freaking thing. Diced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. All right, so I gotta try and find a way in. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. Uh, confident. You went. He, he, he was so, sleeping. How are you doing? Good, but a little cold. Think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Is Chris, been, Chris has been nice so far. He's asked questions of everyone. Oh. Matt, been a while. Rough season, huh? Yeah, something like that. Hey, you okay, man? Some people, you know. You think you know them? Okay. <laughs> Keeping Chris out and friendly. So, see Nash yet? Um, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. I see he has a crush on. How's, uh, how's she doing? She's fine. Why? No reason. They both got a crush on each other. Do they not know? Sorry, Josh, mate. I was just chatting to everyone. You know, mate, maybe yappa. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Uh, oh. Oh. Um, absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? Just going to be a little guy, why not? That could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley I say no parents. Last. How old are they? You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. I'm too confident. Know, man. How can you 
not know. What if it's like weird? And what if she she might like want to be friends with me anymore if I try something like that? Yeah, I that's mean, fine. Are you just listening? You got a bug. He's a nice guy. Grow up here. So how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. There's some windows up here. There's, what's this? Hmm. Oh, there was an axe, but it's gone. Clue found. Axe holder. Clue four. Okay, so actually, I'm, to, I'm supposed to press R1. I've missed more clues. Crap. Damn, I'm getting pretty low in juice here. Oh, well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. open yes oh I'm okay should have paid more attention in climbing class you mean Jim yeah you know with the climbing up the rope whoa oh did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Well, the light bulb just exploded. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. Well, what, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, like I don't know. How's, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on, it's a can. Oh, yeah, now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we do with the Lormy dudes. Yep, ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye bye, frozen lock. Bingo. Actually, it's a decent idea. Right, so I was like, what's it on about? I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. <laughs> I'm enjoying this game's like just very unique and just different. At least the games that I've played. Let me explore some clues around. What's that on the floor? Oh. Totem. Flame thrower, not good. Bad. Maybe you shouldn't use a flame thrower. Okay, you can go through here. It wasn't there another door through here, wasn't there? talking about oh oh wait what's that character traits honest brave he's not very brave oh okay actually answer convicted so for arson here and the mystery man he is So there's an extra janitor on the loose who's wanted for arson, maybe. He's setting stuff on fire, and I was in a premonition of someone on fire a minute ago. One of the girls, can tell what girl it was, though. There's a 
family picture. Huh? That's cool. Hannah's wearing a distinctive locket. Interesting. Well, she is. Am I due to find that at some point then, maybe? Huh? What door just opened or closed? One what of the, the hell two. was that? Pretty dark over here. The wind is alright. So locked or frozen. Oh. Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? On it. I'm trying. Press R2 doesn't turn on. Need some power, maybe. I found out there's clues and like totems and stuff, and now I'm going to want to walk around. Oh my god, this house is massive. She's got a butterfly tattoo on. I didn't press it quick enough, I don't think. Hannah, Sam, Mike, Emily. Why is that a clue? You're insane that way. Locked. This one down here. What new message? Okay. New message. Hi, Mrs. Washington. This is Sergeant Tate again. It's bad news, I'm afraid. Yeah, we've been through the case files, and there's nothing we can do. He's a free man. We don't have the legal power to restrict his movement. Uh, I know it's not what you wanted to hear. Don't call me. Send a message. So the arsonist is a free man. He, he's a person who, I guess, they had suspicions on. Let's make this racket. Downstairs and upstairs, what do you go to first? That was creepy. That's just down in the window. I think you'd go upstairs first, wouldn't you? Upstairs, so it's more welcome than downstairs in a the house. There's a the noise of windows it's annoying me as well. Is that closed then? That's his bloody bathroom.
Then how tall this bloody lodge? downstairs, isn't it? Anything in this corner before I go into this room? Yes. Hmm. Clue found best horror film. Bob Washington. Josh's dad was a director. Guess how he bought the house, the lodge. a deodorant can. What the bloody shit was that? Why don't we even was that? Perfect. We're freezing our buns off out here. And that will never get you laid. The girls freezing their buns off. Freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, tiger. It's just a cute little baby wolverine. Baby, don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Don't undermine me. I've bloody and out there in the dark. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Is there any power in this here. place? Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Oh. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. Oh, beef. You just take whatever you want anyway. Right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Challenge. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. Through the telescope. Before? Mm. We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Right. Right. I'm sure it's all it was. You know what? You can think whatever you want. It's a free country. Watch yourself, Mike. Slight little bit of beef. Might not, you know? Can't have the highway every time. And now you can try and act all lovey dovey with Jess. Oh my god. That is. So gross. Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Yeah. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you oh, say what something? Going on? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Shut up, Matt. Oh. Stay out of it, you dumb oaf. Hey, watch it. Oh, oh you're God. the only one who could put him down? No one else can play with your toys. You're such a bitch. Oh. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 
4.0 bitch, on a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. Are you serious? You think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Um. Oh, what do I say? You gotta, you gotta shut your mouth, Jess. Or just to try and defuse it. But then it looks like I'm not on her side. But yeah, maybe I don't trust her that much, so. Emily, stop. This is out of hand. And there's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex boyfriend, huh? Stop Max. it. This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for 10 minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Want to go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. <sighs> Glad that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh... Should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. On oh, Rodeo Drive. Listening. Oh my God, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my God, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I... you? Oh, someone cut off Emily, actually. You know what? Can we cut off Emily and Jess quite early? I must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> oh, dear. Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. <sighs> then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Okay, she's taking a bath. The two couples are split up. Where's Chris? <sighs> Exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Ugh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes on. <laughs> if we ever make it. I think it's the cabin where feeling looks on our side. The intro. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. You're gonna need these. Porn star? I paid to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. Oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. <laughs> she was excited there, you know, by the way. Oh, you go down there. I'm just going to check out what's on this little patio. Because you never know what you can find, you know? A bit of game design. What's going to happen to us? Bunch of deer. Get angry. The danger totem. Sorry, Jess. I saw a totem I wanted to get involved with. Hey, Hot Lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. Read his mind. A 
Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy and it's very inaccurate. You take a photo of any lady and she'll be like, oh I look That's awful in this cabin. one, even if it's the greatest photo. Noted. Unless she just maybe she just loves herself, that's what it is. She just thinks she she just thinks she's the best. Burr, it is freezing out here. And she says burr uh, and she's got And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Oh, what's that? Private property, Washington in Washington Estate. The film director? Washington? Bob Washington? Father of Josh? Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going Where's on. Where's that come from? Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. Um, hello. Not my problem, Mike, and not yours either. Uh. No, I mean, of course not. I'm just saying it's. I guess it's not worth kicking her when she's down. Because I'd much rather spend my time getting down with you. You see, you see what I, I did there? I Was she bought? Did that for you. Yeah, okay. But she better stay down, is all I'm saying. Facts. <laughs> Got rejected from that. But why? I think this is the cabin. No, the, where the, the wind was closing and then it, it closed. Mike! Maybe it isn't this one. Nice to fire up the Jenny and get moving. What's a Jenny? The generator, mate. All right. Let's see. Isn't this though? Wrong cabin. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. And pull. Woo! You are a wizard. I know. The arsonist. Look cool though, like a Call of Duty character. Oh, she's playing a song. We just can't hear the song because there's copy because they've got the stream mode on. I was like, what are you on about? That was pretty good. You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure. A sexcapade. <laughs> yeah, maybe might as prefer just for that. Oh, where? From Hannah and Beth. You'd think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Uh. Be respectful. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. Oh, and the lag. This is why it's got mixed reviews. It's occasional like lag spikes like that. Not bad though. Um, Did you hear that? that? I heard. Something. Like an animal though, right? Yeah. I was just gonna yep. Yeah, sure. Damn. 
I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge. Looks like I'm that way. Wax museum to drink She's going. Chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. We will find another way around. I like the idea of hot chocolate, I'm not going to lie. Nah. Fuck. That's gonna be half your dollar tank, is it? Is it? Hey, I'm okay. Why is she going the wrong way? Crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I, uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Yeah, I've got a joiner. Why not? All right, coming after you. Just stay put. <gasps> hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? Help me move it. Help me move it. <laughs> you can't dive then. When I imagined us cautious. grunting together, this is not what I pictured. <laughs> Uh. Who wrote this game? I was just feeling very horny at the time, wasn't he? Came around the corner at like two miles an hour. Oh, left or right? Oh, Nelly. This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. See what I mean? Like, what? Yeah, who the little fuck little wrote this game? Insurance. I'm staying for the cabin buster. in her underwear on the floor bloodied up fortune totem I should owning all of this kind of sick Let's go left again, but what if this? Oh my god! You all right? Uh, yeah, close one. Game is trying I don't to kill think me. This place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. Jess, hang on, mate. There could be something behind us that I want to check out. I like to explore. Now, what's that? Candle. It's a cigar stub. Miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> nah, no hey, it's, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? The deer. Oh. It's a map. Jesus. This place is a real fixer-upper. Finally, a little ray of hope. Alright, 
side. Have we gone around the staircase? Cabin. What's this way? Nothing. What am I doing in this cabin again? Other than her trying to go on a sex capade? You gave me a task here, I swear. Well, well. When Josh said cabin, I thought like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'm take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> <Bloody hell. laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, buddy. Oh, a telescope! Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Oh. Uh, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. She like messing with me? Sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. Wait, did you just firm that and believe what? I just saw something at the end, no? Did you not see what I saw? Grizzly bears, Rocky Mountain elk. Are oh, that elk not deers? Some elk ahead of us. Oh god! Oh god! What's that? Watch out, bird brain. Um. Have rats with wings. Oh, poor Mikey! Did the little birdie get your panties all bunched up? See some crows. The diseases and shit. What was there, though? What was there? These bloody totems. Someone dying in a coat. They were falling in a mine, maybe in a lift? That's her. She was under there earlier. I'm far. What? That's fortune, maybe. That's a good thing. No, but she, uh, she, uh, she was covered in blood. <sighs> oh, damn it, Josh. Wouldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Oh, no fair, Harry Spector. Show off. I should have snowballed him as well. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Snowball. Oh. Okay. Okay. That's how it's gonna be. Uh oh. Yes? Now oh, she's pranking me, surely. Surely she's pranking me. Daddy! 
probably just kind what? of to... Wanna help me get this fire going? No, I'm trying to bath, uh, mate. Well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy R. Come on. I hear creepy right, guys behind her or something. You know hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Gosh. I need to check out this side of the bathroom yet. So. Nothing there, I guess. Dinosaur. place we used to have a spirit board oh what wow you have a spirit board <laughs> yeah yeah those things are a joke man don't do shit no way bro i mean we used to do it all the time me and well hey, josh no hot water is kind of major oversight don't you think yeah well, yeah you just gotta fire up the boiler it's in the basement yeah of course all right you guys see if you can find the spirit board chris let's go find it it'll be like a scavenger hunt and we're um, gonna okay. Guess on the boiler. I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Uh, they are yeah, sweet together. Very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over. They'll push in the right direction. Traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric <laughs> ward before Chris makes a move. Give Chris a home. Chris is nice. Like, do we trust Chris though? Because he had some messages. I think, I think looking back now, the messages were from Ashley. Locked. Sorry, man. Just trying to see if I can find anything else before I come with you. Lots of totems and stuff to find when you do that. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh. I just wanted to say. <sighs> what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year, and you know that you came, Sam. Reassuring. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? It seems quite strange, doesn't he? Something like off about him. I want to keep him alive because hey, it's step. called Josh, but. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm hmm.
Why has he walked off so fast? Is he going to jump out at me? He's in there. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. He kind of adds to the creep, on your not gonna lie. Here, can you... Can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Not moving. Not moving. Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mmm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Just a tiny little knob, really, right? Let it in. Ah, oh, damn. It's okay. I'm just try again. Do more pressure. Ah! Relax. It's not that hard. Just press the button when the light comes on. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I'll get it this time. You didn't say that. Playful. Okay. Oh my god. Don't move. What? Something behind you. Yeah, right. Josh. Seriously. There's something back there. Got him. <laughs> all right, all right, your point. Thirty love. What? No. Where'd you get the first point? Does it start at 30? No, 15. 15. No. Oh. More of a ping pong, yeah. <laughs> Wait, okay, so you hear that too, right? Josh. How much better does this game look compared to 2015? I'm curious, because I feel like this looks really sick. Really regular. No, no, nothing regular about it. We should go check it out. Why? I don't know, what if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Being pranked. It's Chris. He's found a spirit board, and it's Chris. Don't stress, guys. Nice. 
Nice one. That was good. Wait, uh, why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was uh, it? Yeah, because it, it it's down to the director. Take of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have been What well, if there was more clues down in the basement, Joke though? Are you finished checking them out? I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. You have the flashlight on facing downwards. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. Okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Mm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. What about the other two? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. I guess like this is all gonna heat up out of nowhere. One person's gonna die and it's all just gonna go nuts. Right, so we need to go back. What's this way? That way. Here you are, madam. Why, thank you, sir. Hey, M. Yeah? I think we should start the weekend over. Right now. Clean slate. Oh? No arguing. No Mike. No Jess. Just Jess can't be dead now, so. You and me. Enjoying ourselves and all this nature. Oh, you mean oh natural? Damn straight. I can get with that. Just gonna check up here real quick. Who knows what I can see? Swing moving by itself. Creepy at all. I should go all the way back down to where the cable car was. And I hope that you're going to find your bag. That way, nothing happens to one of us. Yeah. That was a weird reaction. Maybe just then turn the lights on, it's fine. Or lights have sense on them, maybe. What is the right? That interests me. It interests her, too. Hey, doofus, come this way. You, uh, trying to get me somewhere private? Why don't you uh, come find out? I'll just leave her. Curious about this swing. What the fuck? <laughs> Anna. Is there a decapitated naked baby? That's weird. Oh, guess we gotta go this way. He 
you doing, weirdo? What? I came back. Good boy. Now, okay. Nah. What in the cackle do do am I? That. Submissive map. Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. A little. Uh. Boast, no prob, babe. Salt is fine, really. It's no prob, babe. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. You gonna back that up? All day. <laughs> what? All day. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Like, all day long. <laughs> I was being, like, sexy. That was him being sexy. My God. Days of it. Bridge we crossed. Yeah. It's so nice to be here with you, muscle man. Ah, uh, I'm not all muscle. There are some brains in here too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that brawn. You ever done it outside before? Outside of what? My car. I like your car. Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? We're trying to find places to sleep with each other. What's going on? What? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places. Oh, the L. I already started clearing this off for us. Like a gentleman. Well, oh, come on. Let's look around. All right. So I'm now going to look for a better spot to sleep with her. What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Who needs undies? Well, hell, we don't need those. You don't want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off anyways. Maybe I want to show them off. Puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. That was him being sexy again. See that? Look at the sexy kisser on this thing. Dare to put your hand in it. Day, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. Ah! Oh, these pranksters. Anyway, Emily, Emily. I'll rescue you. Emily! <laughs> gotcha, big dip. Us. You're ridiculous. Oh, come on. What's that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just an animal. Do you not like. Interesting sounding animal, I'm not gonna lie. Hang on. Before you go, Emily, I just need to go down here again and check. Um, where's the staircase gone? Should go check down here. There might be some totems or something. Oh, so you've gone the opposite way to the noise. Madam. Okay, fair. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. I thought I was saying cool down there though. Stick. Hey. What the hell? Somebody made a snowman. Uh, that was not there before. Is that a note? 
I'll come back. Oh. Uh... My penitentiary. It's the arsonist. It's gotta be Chris. Or Josh. They're just trying to mess with us. Kind of uncool, guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? Oh. What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. Oh. Back with the doctor. I would like to understand your feelings toward people with fear the supernatural, ghosts, spirits, and other intangible forces beyond the veil. Do you share this fear? No. No. You said I did, though. Then how do you feel about people who are afraid? They're fine. Well, Mike has a fear of isolation. Do you feel pity for him? Uh, it's a fear of isolation. So, what, you always want someone with him? Sure. I feel pity. Well, this is not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? No. I'm being told off. Now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Who am I? Who are you talking to? Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Oh, good question. Honesty is good. Loyalty is really good. Honesty is really good. It's been honest in general all around. But you could be, you could be bad to be honest. Too honest. Oh, I value loyalty. You know, you can... They're both the same lie thing. In order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? What? You would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need. Oh, no, I don't know. See, so you're twisting what I'm saying here, mate. Huh? You asked me just simple yeah, questions. I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. He's put me under pressure. Is that in the chapter two then? Do you want to all chapters end with him talking to you? Yeah. All right, well, there we go. Another episode of Until Dawn done. If you enjoyed it and want to see some more, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Obviously, the rest of the series will be on this channel here, opposed to my Zaka Play channel. And if you're not already, please do subscribe to this channel. Uh, Trying to get to 150k subscribers. It's slowly creeping and climbing up. It's a nice little channel where we play. We actually play for games. That's what it's called. Actually plays for a reason. Uh, see you guys next time. Goodbye.